Hello everyone, this is Paul from OrthoEval Pal. Today we're going to talk about the auto and knee rule. And if somebody has sustained a knee injury, and not only a knee injury, but maybe even an ankle injury, it's important to be able to identify uh, certain uh, tender spots or palpable tender spots that would indicate sending them to the emergency room for uh, an x-ray. So the different areas you need to look at would be the uh, patella. So if they have isolated discomfort directly over the patella, um, that's one sign. The other is to palpate the proximal fibular head. Now it's important that you don't just palpate this fibular head with a knee injury, you palpate it with an ankle injury also because you can sustain a lateral fibular fracture, uh, proximal, mid or distal, and uh, I've seen it where people have had some uh, fracturing of the proximal fibula. So it's important that you palpate that. If they have tenderness in the fibula, proximal fibular head, patella tendon, and they can't flex the knee to 90 degrees. And again, like the foot and ankle uh, rules, if they can't walk four steps, they can't bear the weight, it won't, the knee won't hold them up, then they need to go to the emergency room and have an x-ray taken uh, or be sent to an orthopedic office where they can assess and um, do some diagnostic imaging on that patient. So those are the uh, most specific spots to check on the Ottawa knee rules. And um, if you have any questions or like to make any comments, please uh, leave those comments in the, uh, the bottom section of this video. And uh, please uh, make sure you subscribe to our channel and you uh, like our videos. Thanks.